Okay, how's it going guys? And welcome back to some more Pokemon Reborn. So, uh, before we continue the story and, uh, you know, go talk to Fern, there's a couple things that we can do. So, first off, I have a lot of money now because I sold the uh, protein and calcium that I found earlier, and I have a lot of money. So, I think this guy wanted 500 for a Pokemon, so I'm gonna go ahead and give it to him. Yes. Thank you, thank you. Wait, what? Badass, you say? Not a bad deal. I think I'll just help myself. Wait, what? The Pokemon was... Oh. See ya, nerds. Well, I uh, got my money. That's your problem now. Wait, what? But if you really wanted to get that ultra-rare Pokemon, you could try and find that guy. Thugs like him hang out at the end of the tracks in the Peridot Ward. Good luck. Okay, so I just lost $500 for nothing. All right, well, that happened. Anyway, uh, there's also... Okay, so over here, uh, this guy was originally blocking this path, but I gave him, like, I think it was, like, a total of, like, $150 or $200, and he uh, he moves out of the way. So uh, now we have access to this building down here. Let's go ahead and see what's in it. It's a uh, Sinchino. Or a Minchino. Minchino looks scared. Minchino smells the pokey snacks. Minchino snapped back to reality. Yes, I'll take Minchino with me. Of course I will, dude. There's no way this thing has skill link, right? There's no way. Yeah, I didn't think so. Technician's not bad, though. Not bad. I would prefer skill link, but not bad. Has pound and baby doll eyes. Okay, okay, okay. Alright. So, uh... So that, there was that. We got a free Minchino. Uh, there's also, if I can find it, where is that? There was an empty building that's not so empty anymore. I think it was this one. Yes, right here. There's a Wismer. Wismer is drawn to the pokey snacks in your bag. The hungry Wismer attacked. Okay, so this, the Wismer doesn't just join my team. He attacks me. All right, well, that's interesting. I missed. Lovely. Okay, well. Oh, I got a great ball. All right, that's fine. We're finding too many normal types, so it's kind of whatever. But yeah, there was a Wismer in there. Uh, there's also another thing somewhere up north. Hold on. I think it was this building. Yes. All right, let's liberate the Pokemon and escape quickly. Understood. If this woman figures out we're targeting her, she's sure to flee reborn. That's one more. We've been found. It's of no consequence. There's no way to know where we're headed. Hey kid, stay out of our business if you know what's good for you. All right, so they're the ones that are robbing the old lady with the, uh, the Iggly buff. So I guess we can go deal with that real quick. Uh... Was the building all the way down here? No. Was it? Oh, no, this is the thief. Hold on. Well, well, look who it is. If it ain't the sniveling little twerp from the Grand Hall. I suppose you want the Pokemon you bought, huh? Then I'll tell you what. I'll sell it to you for another 500. What do you say? Yeah, sure. Now we're talking. Fork it over, pal. Perfect. Now here's your Pokemon. Not. Why would we just give it to you? We already got all the money we wanted. Curious who we is? Come on out. Oh my god. Why were you... He was a box? Huh. Surprise. Hey there, friend. How you doing? Always appreciate your business. Love the money you gave us. $1,000. Not bad. And the best part is, we don't even have to give you the Pokemon. Huh. Not unless you can think you can beat both of us in... Not unless you think you can beat both of us. Uh, I, I do think I can. Maybe. Depends on the level of your Pokemon. Fletchling and Clauncher. Okay. Um. Wait. Nice. 
Huh? You what? Maybe this has gone on for enough already. <laughs> oh, now they're scared. You know, we still ain't giving you nothing. Uh, just stop. This is too much. You ain't chickening out on me now, are you? How can you do this to me? Just give them the Pokemon already. The truth is, bud, I can't. What? What are you talking about? To be honest, I know we were staging it when, when I stole the Pokemon from you so we could rip trainers off, but... On my, on my way over here, I got jacked for real. <laughs> this kid bumped into me, pickpocketed me, and ran off to the Obsidia Ward. Are you kidding? What a joke. I ain't, but hey, we, we got a thousand off of, off of it still. That's better than you... That's better than you got ripped off when you bought that Pokemon. We did it. Uh, we could have done it again, too. If it weren't for that punk. But hey, a thousand ain't bad, right, buddy? I'm throwing in the towel. Let's scram. Wow, okay. So we're gonna go on a wild goose chase for this, uh, this Pokemon, aren't we? You said a kid stole it and ran off to the Obsidia Ward. So whenever we get to the Obsidia Ward, we should, uh, you know, look around for the kid. Anyway, uh, I think it was this building. Yes, here we are. Help! No one's gonna help you, miss. This Pokemon belongs to Team Meteor now. What? You found us after all. Is that so? Then I'm afraid you'll just have to be eliminated. Oh, God. This is an attack. So brace for impact. To eliminate this infestation, they got their own Team Rocket chant. Oh, my God. To restore the art of God's own nation. <laughs> to break apart the world above. To find what lies beneath truth and love. Team Meteor. Resonating with the eternal light. Run away now. Don't try to fight. For justice. That's right. Oh, God. <laughs> they have their own Team Rocket chant. I can't believe it. That's awesome. I didn't heal my Krikatoon. That's not good. Um... Oh boy. This is a problem because we can't really do much to the, uh, to the Duskull. Yeah, we're in trouble. I literally can't touch this Duskull with anything. The only thing that can attack is my, uh, my Krikatoon, but it's pretty low on health. No, I, I literally lost. I literally can't attack it. I literally can't attack it. All my moves are normal. I literally can't attack it. Well, uh... If only, ah, oh, dude, Skitty had Foresight before, but I got rid of it. Dang it, man. Oh, this is not good. <laughs> We're gonna be here forever. We have to wait until this thing run out, runs out of moves and starts to struggle. That's literally what we have to wait for, dude. Oh my god, I can't believe it. I literally can't believe it. This is going to take forever. Okay, a hundred years later, we finally got our Skitty to start struggling, and we knocked out the Duskull. Holy heck, dude. That took forever. Oh, man. How could we fail? I knew this would be a problem. If we continue, we jeopardize our main objective. Retreat. Thank you so much for saving my precious Pokemon. I don't know what I would have done. But what if they come back? They'll definitely come back. I couldn't bear for my precious baby to fall into the hands of the of thugs like them. I know, you. 
Please keep it safe and eliminate those people. Will you? You saved it once. I'm sure I can trust you to watch over it. Okay, yeah. Igly buff looks frightened. Yes. Alright, cool. We get a free Igly buff. Not bad. It's fairy type, right? Yeah, fairy normal. Cute charm. Neutral nature. Ooh, perfect IVs in attack, special, and speed. That's crazy. Has pound, charm, wish, and defense curl. Alright, cool. I need to go heal, dude. That literally took like a hundred plus turns. That's... Oh, man. I should have kept Foresight just for situation. I didn't think a situation like that would, would come up. But it did. That was crazy, man. All right. So I think that's everything that I found, at least. So now we can continue on with the story and uh, let's go talk to Fern. Where is he at? He's... Right here. Well, look at that. You actually came. And here I was worried you'd be too busy. Oh. The place is shut tight, but that figures. We'll just have to find some other way in. Flashbang entrance. Oh. Dynamite throw. Go, electrode. Kaboom? Okay. Well, that's one way to break in. Hocus Kaboken. The door is now broken. <laughs> What the hell, woman? Where'd you even come from? Ask your sister to tell you when you're older. <laughs> I'd rather not, thank you. But speak of the devil. What are you two doing here exactly? Stopping the bad guys, duh. Recent police intelligence suggests multiple large-scale destructive operations are being coordinated from within the given in industrial facility. So, unfortunately... That's my sister, Florina. Florinia? Florinia. As you can see, she's allergic to words with less than three syllables. No such allergen exists. This speaker simply understands the importance of maximizing precision and efficiency of language through whatever vernacular is deemed most... <laughs> I can't do this, dude. <laughs> like I said, some people call her Flobot of that. Well, I call her Rinny because she's not a Flobot. She's a Rinny, though. She's a Rinny through and through. And like she said, we got a report saying a group, a group here is plotting to blow more stuff up than just Grandview Station. Like the gym. My gym. The only one who's allowed to blow up my gym is me. So I, so I was on the money. As it happens, we were also just coming here to clean up the police's mess. Well, and Marks. Wow. Despite traditionally good intentions, breaking and entering property without proper warrant and procedure remains punishable by law. Hey, Flobot, you ever heard of this thing? It's called not being a wet blanket? <laughs> Rennie is right. As average citizens, you could get in serious trouble for trying to barge in on private property. Unauthorized. Luckily, we're both gym leaders. So consider yourselves authorized. <laughs> now let's get in there and get to business. According to super top secret ultra, ultra ninja intel, this building belongs to a group called Team Meteor. Weird name, right? And why does everyone have to be Team Something? Isn't that just broadcasting to the world that they're bad news? <laughs> but they're totally the same ones that blew up Grandview Station. And if we don't get in here and boom their faces off, they're going to cause havoc. A practice I normally approve of, but not like this. So all troops, move out. Leave it to the electric leader to steal our thunder. <laughs> Whatever. Just try not to slow us down, Mark. And if you can figure out how to be slightly helpful on the way, that'd be great. Wow. My feelings are hurt. I can't believe this. Okay, well... Let's go in. This place smells terabad-tastic. The observed wine hue is indicative, indicative of exorbitant levels of pollutants. Estimated toxicity 90 plus percent. Dang. 
so they're polluting the lake as well as committing arson. Either way, they're still the bad guys. We, we gonna do something about it or are we just gonna stand here sniveling? Rather than a source of active pollution, this facility appears to be collecting data on the water and... Wait, wait, wait. Where'd all the teeny words go? Data purge suspect... Data purge suspected. Hypothesis. Facility operatives have begun procedural deactivation of non-critical systems to avoid divulging gathered data and information. Then let's stop twiddling our thumbs and get moving already. We don't exactly have the privilege of stealth after a certain someone announced our presence by blowing up the entire front door. What? Am I not just... Am I supposed to just not blow things up? Don't be ridiculous. The path diverge, diverges ahead. The most efficient course of motion through the facility for thorough investigation and, re, and re, reclama, reclamation? reclamation of the property necessitates a similar bisection of the party. Could you try speaking English for once? <laughs> she said we should split up. Duh. Rennie will come with me. We'll take the side route. Mark, you go with Fern. Try not to let his attitude get to you. Excuse me? Nothing. Come on, Rennie. Let's go. Proceed with caution. I always do, sis. You were not the intended recipient of my previous statement. <laughs> Permission for you to be life-endangeringly reckless granted. Jesus. As you can see, she didn't get enough hugs growing up. Not my problem. Well, Mark, looks like it's you and me after all. Come on, smile. You're lucky you... <laughs> You're lucky you have me to carry you. <laughs> Just try not to slow me down, got it? Oh, God. <laughs> Why do I have to be with Fern? <laughs> oh, man. So... The esteemed guests of honor have arrived. Who? Oh. Who? I know they say you should knock before you enter, but I don't think they quite meant for you to knock the entire door in. Kind of you to announce your calling, though. Not that it was entirely necessary when we already got a tip that the police had found, had found just this place. But kind nonetheless gives us ample time to drop a few bibbity bop 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 buttons and boop. Oh. Data was released to the wild. Bye bye Data. The name's Ace, by the way. First rate agent. Stat. I don't know how to say that word. Stat tits. Uh, okay. Systematic admin. Master magician and professional dead-end to meandering little vagrants like yourselves. In the first place, you should know that I'm more I'm more steamed than a sauna. What? <laughs> that we have to go around dumping all this carefully collected information. I mean, sure, it'll be on the network. Who doesn't use cloud storage these days? But still, it feels bad. How could you do this to me? And there's so much to go through and delete. These file transfers say it's two hours remaining. Wait, two minutes? Nope, three hours. Who knows how long it'll take? So if you could just stay there in place, stand right there. Yes, just like that. Silly expression and all, for just some time more. We'd be much obliged. I suspect you won't though. Grunts? What an unfortunate name, by the way. Isn't that disrespectful? <laughs> but if you wanted to be called something else, you should have been better. <laughs> anyway, little grunts, please show our guests. Wait, what? Please slow our guests down. Buy me enough time and I'll buy your wages another day. What? Uh, okay. What the hell is their problem? I was expecting some kind of sinister team. Not a spring-picked, not, wait, what? A spring-picked fruits basket. 
Let's just get up there and wipe that stupid smile off their face. Uh, I would like to look around first. Elevator locked. Oh, I don't have a... Okay, I don't... I don't have a, a code for that. Oh, hello. We have a goal to achieve. You won't get in our way. What are you doing there? Or what are you doing here? Oh, a Lolan Grimer and Zubat. Okay, okay. Um, I can't really do much with Cricketoon, so we'll swap into Fennekin. Nice. Is he going to keep my team healed? Hopefully. The screen lights up. Active project notes P04. The rest seems to have been deleted. That doesn't sound good. Hmm. You shall not pass. Absorb? Um, no. Oh, we got a number. Three. Okay, cool. One down, three to go, I guess. Ooh, spark! Wait, that's huge. Let's uh, let's get rid of growl since it does the same thing as charm, but charm's better. Seven. Okay, so it's three something seven. Three one seven. <laughs> Maybe we could learn more if you weren't slowing me down. I can't believe this, Fern. I already went there. Do I have to get up there? Hmm. 
Did I miss a number somewhere? I mean, we could guess the last number, technically. Oh, right here? There we go. 3179. Looks like there's only two floors. Hit it, Mark. Hey, what gives? Sorry, little wannabes. I'm afraid the power's been cut on your little hit and rescue operation. The trap in the box tricks gets them every time. Be good little fledglings and stay put there until the show is over and we've dealt with your gym leader friends, will you? Like hell we will. Oh, well. That's awkward because, you see, you don't actually have a choice in the matter. It was one of those rhetorical questions, you know? Don't worry, little one. You'll figure those out eventually. Why don't you think on it while you're trapped here? Actually, better idea. You two are obviously strapping young lads with a sense of justice and urgency. I know you just got here, and this offer usually comes closer to the climax, but... Let's just get out of the way now. Would you consider joining us? Our methods might not be popular, and that's kind of the point, you know? But I promise you this, little heroes. We're the ones looking out for this region. We come with great insurance and family plan. Oh, really? <laughs> Give it a think, yeah? Let us out of here, and I'll tell you exactly what I think. <laughs> nope. I'll come back and check on you once we're all cleaned up, though. So until then, just stew on it. Uh... There's Julia. Agent, the front wing has been destroyed. The gym leaders are coming up. Just when we'd gotten a break. I suppose I'll deal with them myself. Hang tight, you two. Primary security overwritten. Elevator power restored. No, no you, no, you just did not. That's my security station, woman. Drat. Uh, I guess Flobot can be good for something occasionally. Let's hustle, Mark. Double Drat. One I could take. Two's a fair bout. But three's a whole crowd. And four is right out. What? Consider this a tactical, if temporary, retreat. This commander will have orders, I'm sure. Or the commander will have orders. Ta-ta for the time. Please feel free to show yourselves out at your own leisure. Okay. Hey, get back here so I can blow your fa- Jesus! Ha, what a coward. Meteor headquarters confirmed beyond gate. So then, it's just a matter of opening it. I'm sure Electrode could blow this up too, but I'm starting to run out of revives here. Oh my god, that's so cruel. <laughs> you use your Electrode to explode and just revive it and explode and revive and explode? Jesus. It's brutal. This facility's digital security system appears substandard. The primary firewall has been accessed. Only a secondary one remains. A brute force attack should be sufficient. Please hold. Brute force. Rennie, I don't think we're going to be able to punch through the door. But they were responsible for blowing up the station. And they were planning to hit my gym, right? My, my gym. Wait, what? They were planning to hit my gym, right? Two? Right, two. I bet they'd let us borrow their boomies if we asked real nicely. And maybe punched them in the face. Jesus. And then asked nicely again. If we can get those, I can get us past here no problem. Mark, do you think you can do you think think you can find where they keep the explosives? A facility map indicates a storage room behind a security lock on the northern side of the premises. There. I bet that's where they are. If you can do that, we'll be in easily. Why is combustion your solution to every obstacle? Cause it's fun for the whole family. Indeed. Whatever. I, for one, don't care to stand stand around all day 
while Flobot plays with computers. That's the spirit. For once, Fern says something I agree with. Quick mark, to the boom mobile. The what? Ooh. Paralyze seal, not bad. I okay, we need to find another code. Ooh, mini ore and crabrawler. That is dangerous. That thing has Rock Smash? Oh god, I gotta go. I gotta get Fennec into safety. Or not Rock Smash, I'm worried about the freaking rollout. Okay. Four. Nice. Awesome, we got a breaks in. Eight, so it's four eight. Hangrowth, Grass Poison. Huh? What are these guys talking about? Tangrowth isn't even a poison type. <laughs> Maybe they made it a poison type. 4, 8, something, 2. Okay. Again, we could brute force the last number. I think I'm just gonna brute force the last number. So it's four, eight. Was this two? I already forgot. There we go, it was six. Oh, wait. Wait, where, where would... I don't even know where we would find that last number at. Yeah, I don't know where we would... Hmm. Yeah, no clue. Oh, well. Oh, well. Oh my god, Soul Rock and Lunatone. Nice. 
Nice. Good job, Sandile. Psybeam. Huge. Let's get rid of Scratch. I guess this is it. Why is it green? Whatever. If she needs more firepower than this, I think she's going to be under arrest. Probably should be anyway. I'll take the box. Let's scram. Hey, crazy lady, we got your goods. Beautiful, bombastic boomies. Oh, God. <laughs> this stuff is fun. What? You know the specific type of explosives? Uh, obviously. It's named for its green color, but it's unique because the internal chemicals react as they oxidize. In other words, all you gotta do is make it shake, shake its stuff. Wait, what? All you gotta do is make it shake its stuff is... All you gotta do to make it shake its stuff is to break open the plastic casing. Glad I didn't drop it on the way over here. Okay, let's do this. Okay. Three, two, ka, huh? Secondary firewall overridden in line with secondary security failure. Access granted. But the... Oh. Well, okay. Not that there was nothing to even blow up anymore, but I'll take it. Your penchant for wanton destruction remains decidedly soup. Okay. You're right. It is super. And now we will charge ever forward. Go team. But like our team, not Team Meteor. Go. Indeed. She walked right through Fern. Pretty sure Julia should have been arrested a long time ago. Whatever. Let's get a move on. This is where we went, right? Yeah. This is where we needed to go to get that, uh, that last number. Wait, was it? Actually, it's not. I don't see any place to get a number from. So maybe this wasn't the place. Oh, it was down here. Nope. Never mind. Yeah, I don't know where we would have gotten that uh that last number from. Down here? Nope. Oh well. You. Are you the one in charge here? And if I am? We're gonna blow your face off for what you did to Grandview Station. Amusing. Tell me, what power do you think you have to do so? Two among you are leaders of the League, sure. A considerable obstacle, yet hardly much concern. Two others, mere smoke in the wind. Oh yeah, and just who do you think you are anyway? You know already. We are Team Meteor. Though few know it, we are keepers of the history. Shepherds of our region. Shepherds of the region. Some shepherds you are. We kicked your whole basin already. Pat yourself on the back as much as you'd like. But we never had any reason to stop you. Like a toddler who will kick and scream and cry themselves to eventually sleep, you've been allowed to do as you pleased. Our purpose here was forfeit already. Your city has been watched for quite some time. We've got metrics on everything, from water quality to Pokemon population and the lives of the people. If it exists, we probably knew about it. And now, just like that, everything is off the system. We made the mistake of overestimating your little raiding party. Time was ample, and I grew tired of this dalliance. Aster. Yes, boss? Eclipse. Yeah? 
deal with the small fries. If you say so. Ace, you and I will handle the gym leaders. Cons consider the deck stacked for Team Meteor. Oh, jeez. Oh, we're teaming with Fern. Great. Meteor, Private, Aster, and Eclipse. Okay. They're rocking double Rockroth. Interesting. Good damage. That thing had Fire Fang? Oh my god. Should be an easy win, though. What? Defeated? Oh my god! You have Cradilly, Viper, Electrode? Jeez. You two lost already? Can't you incompetent grunts do anything right? These two aren't so tough, but the four of you all together. Well, it was an amusing diversion. Ace? One smokescreen evacuation coming right up, Commander. The Disappearing Act is a staple of any magician. Now you see us? Oh. Now you don't. Do not make the mistake of believing you've won. You will be remembered. Enemies of the region. Are they gone? Affirmative. We sit them packing with their tails between their legs. Great job, team. You too, Electrode, return. Now let's see. Got it. Okay. You all should start running now. Huh? What did you do now? Ka? Oh. <laughs> let's move. Wow. Don't think that was necessary, but... Okay. Well, that's a wrap. Go team. Uh-huh. If you're done with your pyrotechnics, I'm getting out of here. Unlike Mark, I can't just stand around all day while there's stuff to be done. Peace. Way to sour the mood. This was a perfectly good victory. Souring the mood remains one of his few veritable competencies. However, the speaker is overdue for departure as well. The situation in the Obsidia Ward reportedly continues to deteriorate rapidly. Something weird was going on with the plants there, right? How does that even happen? There's like two plants in that park, if that. The use of the literary device known as under wait what known as understatement is noted. Nevertheless, attention is warranted. Well, boo, fine. I know you've been really distant since our graduation, but I'm glad we can hang out at least a little. Just like old times, right? And equally destructive, correct? However, sentimentalities remain counterproductive. Unrelated, an inquiry for Mark. Did you observe terrain variant effects during that operation? Uh, yes. Then you should already be aware of some aspects of field effects. Recently, many trainers have been documenting the specific attributes of each environment. As such, this speaker has created an application to catalog these attributes and effects. Please allow the beta version to be installed into your Pokegear. Okay, cool. This application can also display in-power, in-battle prompts, indicating which moves will be strengthened or weakened in the given environment. Would you like to turn this feature on? Yes. Regardless, in order for indicators to appear, the application must already must have already been loaded with data for the field effect in question. A small population has already begun recording data for this application. Currently, only data on the electric terrain is stored in the device. Please collect additional information with the help of others or by finding environmental readouts that may have been extracted at various locations. Wait, did you say electric terrain? Rinny, that's for my gym. Are you trying to give Mark a lead on me? 
The speaker will report today's proceedings to Amy and the resident police force before returning to Obsidia. Farewell. Rinny, if you're going to sass me, at least do it with some feeling. She hasn't been the same ever since Tania. Well, never mind. Thanks for your help today, Mark. You were great. And now that my gym isn't going to randomly blow up, I'm going to head back there now. Although if it did blow up, that might be fun too. Whatever. Once you feel ready, you should totally come by and challenge me. I'll be waiting. Bring coffee. Alright, well that sounds like a plan. Anyway, uh, I think for now, we're going to go ahead and end this episode off here. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.